several hundreds have renounced their pagan beliefs and turned to the teaching of Catholicism. A work. I don't have enough space for that. I'm not familiar with this symbol. Locked, but there's going to be a way to open them. There's that symbol again.
knew they'd have a generator here somewhere. Oh, good. Now let's see if I missed anything in the dark. I bet I know what happens if I pick the wrong door. Nothing good. Mm, impossible. I can't carry any more. Questioning why we took it in the first place. The plan is solid. It's gonna take some time to play out. It's just all this damn waiting.
Abby, it's Lara. I'm at the Trinity camp. Some of them were guarding a crab figurine. Oh no. That must be the central offering from the temple. No wonder the earth is still shaking. That crab was stolen directly from Sipakna himself. Abby. You have to put that crab back in the temple, where it belongs. Okay, I will. The crab is traditionally Zapakna's favorite food. In order to set a trap, the hero twins created a decoy crab and used it as bait for him. It worked. Based on the design of this crab, it was probably created as an elaborate offering. It must occupy a place of central importance in the temple of Zapakna. I think I can see the temple site. There's a village in front of it. That's the one. <coughs> the village is abandoned. Because of the mudslide. be a way to open the door. I hope the villagers will be able to return here soon. <laughs> Must be a way to get across. Have to go through the church. Be careful, the buildings are unstable. <sighs> From the age of the paper. I can't believe it. Trinity destroyed the bridge. You'll find your way. Yeah. <sighs> 
I'm inside the temple. Zapakna's eating a crab, his favorite food. Stop it. Too close. Just beautiful. There must be more of these triggers. If I find all of them, they'll push the Pakna back to the top. Yeah. <laughs> 
just beautiful. Deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it. Deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it. That's deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it.
deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it. That's deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it. Deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it. That's deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it. to find a way across. to stop it. That's deadly. I'll have to find a way to stop it.
way across. Find a way to stop it.
where the crab belongs. Get her! Oh, shit. There she is, boys!
Abbey, I'm at Zapakna's temple. Trinity was waiting for me. They stole the crab to lead me into an ambush. My god, are you okay? I'm fine, and the crab is back where it belongs. Oh, that's such a relief. Thank you. Let's hope you returned it in time. Tell Jonah I'm on my way back. God, what is that smell? be a path underwater. This Maya god is very dark brown, almost black, with black rimmed eyes and facial features that seem to be melting at their extremities. Have to drain the room. Is this supposed to be one of the beheaded gods of the underworld?
Impossible. I can't carry any more. This is incredible. Piranhas are feeding on the corpses. Have to find a way up. Have to find a way up. Have to lower the water level. All full up. Can't carry any more. <clears throat> Have to lower the water level. All full up. Can't carry any more. When storms crash and rivers swell, direct the waters to quench the thirst of the gods who toil above and below. Have to lower the water level.
the water level. I don't have enough space for that. lower the water level.
damn it. Have to lower the water level. Lower the water level. Now to get out of this horrid smelling place. I should be close now.
So Abby tells me the whole thing was a setup? Yes. When I returned, the Crab Trinity had a trap waiting for me. <laughs> I guess that's some kind of compliment. They trusted you to bring it back. Thank you so much, Lara. Now that the Crab is back in its rightful place, the ash is gone and the tremors have stopped, I'm not sure I can take credit for all of that. Either way, it never hurts to keep the gods happy. <laughs> when good things come into your life, you've got to celebrate them. a lot to her. Abby's really grateful for what you did. <laughs> you know, I've never seen anyone smile like she does. Abby's really grateful for what you did. <laughs> you know, I've never seen anyone smile like Laura, over here. I need to talk to you. Abby, you look concerned. Is something wrong? No, not really wrong. After you left me and Pilar alone, she gave me Grandma's secret journals. So I've been reading those and there's a lot to absorb. You can't expect to learn everything Mariana knew all at once. It takes time. <laughs> yes. She had a dream once, a vision of the future. In it, she describes a woman who looks exactly like you. Oh. Naturally, I don't want to say too much about it. Yet. After your conflict with Amaru is over, when the fate of the silver box of Ishel has been decided, can you meet me back here? Of course.
Impossible. I can't carry any more. Impossible. I can't carry any more. Must do something to get those children out from underfoot. You figure out the riddle yet? Space for that. There's something there. Looks like there's something here. Fool's gold and costume jewelry. But the kids will love it. So did you find anything? I sure did. Look at this. We're rich. Hold on, hold on. We said everyone gets an equal share, so... Oh no, I couldn't possibly accept any of your treasure. You mean it? Absolutely. I knew it right away when I saw you. I said there's a real hero. Please, please, it was nothing. I only did what any reasonable person would do. Thanks for finding the treasure. We're going to show it to Manu. I don't know how you got Diego and the rest of those kids out of the way, but I'm glad you did. Now we can get to work. Esa mujer está loca. 
Why should we start? Over this way. Thank you for your help. And I hope you find Isa. I'm worried about her. I wish I knew why Isabella was trying to climb the cross. Maybe something about the cross can show you where Isa went. I wish I knew why Isabella was trying to climb the cross. There's an inscription. Look through me to find the way. Maybe something about the cross can show you where Isa went. There's the next cross. Another. <laughs> There's the next cross. Looks like there's something here. for that. There you are. Yes. 
Who are you? Guillermo sent me to find you. He's worried about you. <sighs> Poor Guillermo. He's probably killing himself with guilt, too. <laughs> I guess we were both right. There was a hidden crypt, and I did have an idealized view of what it would be like. How did you injure yourself? I was on a rope when the tremor hit. The shaking threw me into the walls, the rope snapped, and I hit the water badly. Uh, I think my ankle's broken. In order to get you out, I'll have to go back for help. It will take several people. <laughs> What's so funny? Can one of those people be Sarah? I'd love to see the look on her face when she has to admit that one of Manu's fantastic stories turned out to be true. I'll suggest it to Guillermo. Now, I don't think I can get out the way I came in, so I'm going to have to look for another way out. I'll be right back. And I'll be right here. I've always been grateful for my vivid imagination, except for right now. I can't wait to get out of here. May Huascar's knowledge of the two... Where's me? All full up. Can't carry any more. I have returned from my training. I must be on the right path. The air is getting fresher. Don't tease me. I've spent the night in a crypt. Isabella, I see daylight. You'll be out of here in no time. You're amazing. Thank you so much. In preparation for...
have enough space for that. A wheel lock pistol, never mass produced and banned in the Holy Roman Empire. Ostentatiously decorated, a bit much for a missionary, but maybe a fitting weapon for an egoist such as Lopez. Full up, can't carry any more. Please tell me Isabella's okay. She is, but she's hurt her ankle, so we'll have to go back and get her. No, I could not stand to inconvenience you any further. And besides, Sarah tells me you have something important of your own to do. Please, let Isa's friends take care of her from here. You'll need a couple of people and a lot of rope to get her out. I'll round them up right away. 
Where is she exactly? Take the main road across the river, then follow the crosses. Wait, the crosses? Did she find something? She found the crypt man who told her about. She did? That's wonderful. Oh, I'm so happy for her. I should have gone with her, and I feel terrible about her ankle. But despite that, this is the adventure Isa's always dreamed of. She also suggested that maybe Sarah could be a member of her rescue party. Oh, that's a great idea. I'll make sure of it. And speaking of Manu and his crazy stories, if you're looking for something hidden around here, you should probably talk to him. It worked for Isa. He's usually hoarding code around the mission. And thank you again for finding Isabella. I don't know what I would have done if... Just make sure she gets back safe. Even my you must be Manu. Who's that? Who's there? She's the one who found the treasure. Is that right, Diego? Well, well, what can I do for you? I overheard you telling the children about Maya ruins. Finally, someone who pays attention. Well, you were right about the crosses. Isabella followed them to a hidden crypt. Ha! I knew it, I knew it. No one ever listens to old Manu, but I was right. <sighs> so you were. And I bet you're telling the truth about those Maya ruins. I recognize something in your voice. The thrill of discovery, of finding something, some place unseen for hundreds or even thousands of years. There is something thrilling about that, isn't there? There's no feeling like it. The taste of stale, dusty air still gets my heart racing. These modern people, these so-called realists, they close themselves off from such wondrous possibilities. They can't even imagine some of the things I've seen. Ah, that I would give anything to see again one last time. Perhaps I could be your eyes, your witness of those Maya ruins. You could at that, yes. Do you remember where the ruins were? Now, where were they? I remember a pool fed by three waterfalls. Uh, I wish I could give you better directions, but it's been so many years. I should be able to find it. And when I do, I'll come back and tell you all about it. Oh, if you could do that for me. Touch that, that history. I would... I would be so... Say no more, Manu. I'll find it. I hope you've shined up those dancing shoes, Manu. I found the ruin. It was Maya, an ancient aqueduct. It was wonderful, just as you'd imagined. I knew you would! Now, tell me everything. The ruins had flooded because of the earthquake. I swam through tunnels teeming with peril. Go on. I found a vast cavern and a stone tower with massive heads carved into its sides. The Lords of Shibalba, right? Incredible. What else? It must have been an aqueduct of some kind. And you'll never believe this. Most of the machinery is still functional. Water wheels, three men high, turned as smoothly as the day they were built. It was amazing to see Manu. To be so close to all that history where no one has set foot in hundreds of years. <laughs> I see it. I can smell it, feel it, taste it. You, you've brought tears to an old man's dry eyes. I, I can't thank you enough. I, I'd like to give you something. Manu, I, I couldn't. Please, I insist. It's the first relic I ever found. It's beautiful and intricate. A decorated skull. I'd like someone who has the same passion for exploring that I did as a young man to have it. Don't ever let anything kill your sense of curiosity and wonder. I won't. Thank you, Manu. Esto que tiene 
400. Años. Mm, impossible. I can't carry any more. Someone once said if you really want to learn about a town. I hope you've shined up those dancing shoes, Manu. I found the ruin. It was Maya, an ancient aqueduct. It was wonderful, just as you'd imagined. I knew you would. Now, tell me everything. The ruins had flooded because of the earthquake. I swam... How do you do? I have all kinds of stuff. Good deal. That's a good deal for both of us. Good deal. I'm sure you will be satisfied. Good deal. That's a good deal for both of us. I'm sure you will be satisfied. 
That's a good deal for both of us. I'm sure you will be satisfied. Pleasure doing business with you, friend. 